Ashley Hedges is with the Desert Water Agency. Today we are talking about recycling, something you can do with aluminum cans and paper, but also you guys deal with, with water. That's right. So people always ask, what does Desert Water Agency do to conserve? You're out there telling all of us to do it, mm -hmm. and uh, we want to know what you're doing. And water recycling is one big part of that. So we have a water recycling facility and we actually recycle. We're one of the very few agencies in California yeah. that recycles every drop, essentially, of the wastewater in our community. Now, I'm told that it's one of the few agencies that you recycle, yeah, like 100%. How does that happen? So the water, the wastewater is collected by the city of Palm Springs. Okay. And they put it to, uh, through the first two phases of treatment, and then they send it over to us for a final filtration. Okay. And then we take that water and we distribute it to golf courses, parks, schools, our headquarters. Yeah, and I'm told that, that now this is not water that you would want to drink, but again, for irrigation, they say it's terrific. In fact, I've talked to uh, golf course people, they say they never have to fertilize their, their, their golf courses because there's just small, irreplaceable uh, traces of, of stuff in there. That's the beauty of it. So yeah. it's not suitable for drinking water. You yeah. wouldn't want to drink it or have, have your pets drink it. It's not dangerous by any means. You can walk on it, play on it. It's not going to hurt you, um, but it does have a higher mineral content, yeah. which makes it a huge asset for our community yeah. because less fertilizer is used, which means that fertilizer with other chemicals in it doesn't get into the groundwater table. So that actually helps the water supply as well then? Yes, it's a huge benefit in terms of water quality and water supply. Are there plans to increase the amount, or I guess it's kind of hard to increase if you're doing so well already then? So with Desert Water Agency, we're kind of maxed out until our community kind of develops a little bit further. Yeah. So the more growth we see in our community, we can take those additional flushes and showers sure. and, and sink uh, operations and put those into the flow. Okay, so it's important though that people continue to recycle or to do what they can to save water, even though it's not like, well, this will be recycled, so let's just flush the toilet. You still want to do what you can to conserve. Yes, we want people to use water efficiently no matter what our supply conditions are mm -hmm. because it's a, it's a precious resource. But uh, recycling is one, one way that Desert Water Agency can contribute and do its part. Okay, sounds good. Well, we appreciate you being here. And if people want to find out more, they can go to your website. Uh, I imagine there's information on the website where yes. they can read all about this. DWA.org, and there's a whole section there on water recycling, and you can learn about the fact that it's all solar-powered as hmm. well. Okay, thank you so much, Ashley, for being here with us today.